Welcome back, folks. In the last one, we were looking at fuel uh, going to Hialeah, Colombia, uh, Midland, Topeka, and Lubbock. And the way we're going to do this is we're going to set up two new lines. And I think we'll make one of them yellow. We'll go from Murrieta Branch up to Hialeah and up to Columbia Central. And then we do need to make a cross here. Uh, that's fine. Let's quickly do that. Uh, tracks. High speed with catenaries. And I actually think I want to. Ah, uh, there's a. Let's just bulldoze those. High speed with catenaries. And we'll make a cross here. And we'll put some signals in again up here. All right. So now, this is fine. I think I want you to go into. And number one is fine. All right, so that's that one made, and this will be, actually, this is incorrect. Um, because we have to go Lubbock, Olathe, Murrieta, Aaliyah, Columbia, uh, and there's actually no need to stop on the way back until Murrieta branch, unless we have some oil or something that we want to put on here, but it doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like we have anything of that sort right here. So that's good. All right, so this is the line and this is spine, fuel, or fluid to uh, Lubbock and Colombia and whatever's in between yeah all right that's one line then we need another new line going from here to here to here and I don't think there's any reason to make it stop on the way back. Uh, maybe there is actually. So there. And this will be... Uh... Aaliyah Fluid to uh, Topeka. All right, then we just need some trains for it. So let's just say any cargo. What do we have on? this uh cargo line uh 
We have the MILW class EP2. Okay. Uh, so that is a electric train. And we can't get that anymore. This can go 130 only. 89, 160. But it doesn't have great tractive effort. This one has better tractive effort, so let's add that. And then cargo reefer. Cool. Uh, tank cars. These are basically the same. So we can actually only go 120 with our tank cars. So maybe this can do 140. I think this one is better. Okay. Uh, let's uh, one, two, three. Let's go down here. One, two, three. Couple of those. Couple of those. Couple of those. And we're up to 258 meters. 291. 308. 324. Uh, let's go with 306 capacity, 308 meters. We'll buy two of them. Uh, we will make them yellow. Oosh. That's a very bright color. And this is spine fluid to Lubbock and Columbia. Okay, so here they come. Oh, the tank cars were painted yellow as well. I didn't really want that, to be honest, but never mind. And then we need to buy a train for this over here, which is done here. And I think we'll put the same kind of deal on there. Um, let's just use these. 312 meters, 306 capacity. Bye. And this is Hylia. Ooh, to Topeka. It's kind of... Orangey, I think. Okay. So there that comes. And I think that's fine. I think that's fine. Okay. How are you doing? You're actually producing quite a lot. You're coming in with 144 crew. There's none stored. How is there none stored? I suppose I should upgrade these ones. I have 45 of these on the it's a Ford Model 77 truck with side stakes. Um, I don't think we're going to need 45 of them. So let's sell 20. Yes. And then we want to replace these. And we now have the Kenworth. Uh, 
let's do it's the same price and everything yeah let's do these all right let's take a look at the Kenworth well, it's a little bit weird with the trucks here I feel like Well, right, let's just take a look at it this way then. Yeah, they look pretty cool. I feel like the controls for uh, watching trucks is are different than they are for trains. But they're pretty cool. They are pretty cool. Pretty darn cool. Alright. What's the rate on this now? 1702. That's way too much. We can only produce 1200. So... Let's try selling three of them. What's the rate now? 1504. Uh, and let's sell you as well. Then what's the rate? No, 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 no. Uh, manage line, not manage vehicle. 1375. I think that's fine. All right, so that would be okay now. And get moving. Yeah, so they could only carry nine. Now they can carry 36. That's going to be a big difference, I think. Very cool. Okay. So this should mean that these uh, fuel things. Should have. A lot more customers. Columbia is on there okay so they are on there good and where was the other fuel refinery it was down here and it's about to well it just did go up uh, are we not going why all the oh auto save i see It has quite, well, it has a little bit stored up. So that's all good. And you are coming in to pick up, I guess. You're bringing some fuel or oil. You're bringing oil, okay. Good, good, good. You are pretty much producing at capacity. What's our rate on this? 509. We need that up. All right. Guess it's this one. 682 we need it up to 800 um, let's 
Got two more. That should help out with that. And you have basically no oil stored right now. You're coming in to pick up. You're coming in to pick up. You just dropped off. You're coming in to pick up. You picked up. Didn't I... Didn't I tell this line not to pick up? Oil? I guess not. Uh, at Tacoma East, do not load oil. Just fuel, please. So that should be better. Okay. Now we could get more crude going here, but I think we are actually doing enough crude as it is. I think it's act we're actually doing enough crude as is. We have quite a lot of stuff sitting here for the spine fluid hauler. Uh, that's not the spine fluid hauler. That's the spine fluid hauler. What's the rate on it? 511. Um, hmm. Let's do four now and then we can do four again later. Okay. So we have some logs here as well that we could take in somehow. Are you producing logs? You are. We're not getting a lot of them. And I guess that's because of our uh, spine stakeholder. Clone those. Okay. And then we want to, well, I want to, so I hope you do too. Uh, I want to hook this up. So that we can get some more logs done. So let's... Uh, let's upgrade these roads. Okay. And then in Provo, I think we need a second cargo station. Um, do we have other things here that we want to do? Probably, yes. Yeah, we do. We definitely do. So we will do three. Um, Fifteen meters. Uh, if we turn this around and Do this. 
I think that'll work out quite nicely. Okay. And it does reach the rails. So then we need a truck stop down here. And I think we'll use the regular one. Just one platform, 30 meters. And we'll put it alongside here, or even. Like this. Kind of like that. Eesh. Okay, well, sometimes we have to dig into stuff to build. Okay, so that's that. Then we do have a road depot. So, new line from, well, it's from here. Oh, actually, we need to, we need to, uh, so, can we, no, okay, because we need logs to come down here, and we need uh, planks to go back, and they're not hauled by the same truck, so, there to there, we will make you this wonderful color and you will be spine logs to provo blanks okay and then another new line from there to there and you will be this amazing color and you will be provo blanks to spine okay let's get some vehicles five vehicles uh we want the kenworths because they are cool looking and we will take the logging truck uh, we will take let's take 12 for now and make them this color and put them on spine logs to provo planks and then we will take another 12 kenworths of uh, the boxy kind and i think we'll use the day cap to, on that just to make it a little bit different uh, 12 by make you your lovely color and that will be provo planks to spine all right so that's a lot more planks that we are able to make which is fantastic okay 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 okay, okay. I like it, I like it a lot. Now, what's next? I'm kind of considering making a train line from Lubbock down to Yonkers. Because we have all this good stuff. We have slag. We have uh, we have good stuff here. We have uh, machines. So making a train line up there would make sense, in my opinion. And then we could just extend the the lines that are going to Lubbock. To go down to Yonkers. Yonkers needs uh, goods, uh, fuel. And that's not Yonkers. This is Yonkers. Goods, and of course, mail, food, machines, and fuel. 
But I don't mind having a train line going there. So I think we're going to do it. But we'll do that in the next one because we don't have time to set up a entire train line right now. I want to see... Are you producing now? Yeah, we have some logs sitting here, but not that many. How crowded is our spine line at the moment, I wonder? Well, where is... Uh, let's just take a look from here. So we have a train coming in here. We have a train there. Where's the next train coming down? There. And the next train coming down is there. And the next one is there. And then there. But this is also because we just bought a bunch of trains, right? I think. What do we have sitting here? Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Okay. Hmm. So where are our passengers are there and there? Alright, so you should be getting a bunch of stuff, right? 126 and 162. So now we are not overloaded. Which is a good thing. We have the next train coming down there. And you're leaving. And we have a train there. Which is also a fluid train. And then a fluid train, and then a state train, which has nothing on board. And this state train has nothing on board. Okay. And of course these don't have anything going yet. Uh, quite a lot on board. Do, 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 do. Right, we have a lot of different things. Why do you have coffee beans on board? That's a bit of a mystery. I didn't set up coffee production anywhere, did I? Other than over at uh, Santa Rosa, or no, not Santa Rosa, uh, Roseville. So why are we getting beans down here? That's weird. But there is a roaster here. And a coffee farm. Okay, anyway, it doesn't matter. As long as we're transporting something, we're making money. Uh, it's a bit of a tight corner there. Uh, right, so Joliet Forest, Fresno Forest, Killeen Forest 1 and 2 are providers here. That's good. And if we take a look at our forests up here... Uh, 600. Shipment isn't great, though. 
You were crude there. You were bringing up some tools and stuff. To... Madison, I guess. Yeah. Alright. So the towns that we connect to actually grow quite quickly. Which is good to see. 407 <laughs> logs sitting here. Jesus. Okay. The Madison box deliveries. How many vehicles do we have on that? Uh, let's double that number. And how many passengers do we have sitting here? 30? That's not too bad. 145. You just left and you're full. You're half full. Okay. Well, you're empty now, but you're gonna pick up some food, I guess. Or what? What are you gonna pick up here? Mail? If anything? Some food. Alright. Uh, yeah, we're producing food here. Ah, so we need coffee. We can use coffee here. That's why we have coffee on our line. So we're actually producing food here. Ooh, a tiny bit. Well, that's good. That's good. And up here, we're not producing tools, but we will be once we start getting some planks. And we have the Memphis Sawmill down here. What's the rate on you? 705. You can go to a maximum of 800. So... 685. Let's put another vehicle on you. And another vehicle on you. Hopefully we get some logs here soon. I have to go all the way through town, which kind of sucks. Uh, we do have some planks sitting here, though. Some going to Fresno, some going to Green Bay. Are you producing? You are. What's your rate? 541. Kind of need to double that, but I'm not, I, I think we're producing more than enough crude to supply the, the refineries. I really do. Uh, so what we could do, since we have this food thing up here... That needs alcohol, coffee berries, or or uh, coffee beans, or meat. Is that we could, we could hook up some meat or some some more coffee berry uh, beans or some alcohol. I mean, we have alcohol down here at. Um, uh, Tacoma so if we took some grain over here and put it on our on a train going over there and then we could have grain from here as well no this is producing at max so this could actually do with more grain as well do, 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 do. 
so that's a possibility and adding a a gondola thing here and a gondola spine and we could hook into any farms we meet along the way this one this one these three this one that would actually be an option and a pretty good one i think and we could hook into any ores that we see along the line um i want to check uh so gondola yeah so stone silver iron coal slag waste sand all goes in gondolas why doesn't marble go in gondolas what does marble go in They go on flat cars with side stakes, which we already have. Okay. That's kind of interesting. Uh, what's the rate on this? 471. Let's up the rate. And I kind of have a project in mind that I think could be fun. And that project is basically about moving the Olathe train station uh, for passengers to be in the middle here. And then the same for Murrieta. I think that could be kind of fun it's a big project though let's take a quick look at our towns which ones are the biggest lubbock 1251 columbia topeka green bay hylia memphis olath roseville el paso midland where is um so marietta is only 666 santa rosa only 596 that surprises me that surprises me. I guess we're not producing enough of anything really, which makes sense because we're hooking up so many towns so quick. But I kind of like it. I love that these good towns are so big. Look at them. That is a big town. And I like it. I like it. Let's quickly... Uh, I wonder, is, is there a way to remove all overlays? Uh, so, um, uh, suppose we could do this. I think it's a gorgeous town. We really do. And Columbia 2 here. Beautiful town. Beautiful. Lubbock is also really big. As in really, really big. So yeah, I think uh, we have a lot more uh, industries to hook up. Uh, and I think... In the next one, what we'll do is we will hook up Yonkers to Lubbock, both with, I think both with passengers and cargo. And then we'll get the machines here going somewhere else uh, as well, because there are several places that need machines and we're not delivering them because we haven't hooked this up. So I think this would be a really good idea to hook up with the train. So I think that's what we're going to do in the next one. And then after that, I want to hook up to Winston-Salem, Omaha, and so on, all the way up to Abilene, as we have discussed before. Because I want the spine to go all the way up there. I want the spine to go way up there. 
also so that we get these towns growing and industries uh, thriving up here stuff like that i think that would be really cool and then get every city hooked into into our spine somehow and an airport at each end and maybe one in the middle somewhere I think that would be really nice I think that would be really nice but anyway a lot of big plans but they are plans for another day so thank you very much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time